Hey cutie patooties and welcome back to Cutie Nails where everything we do here is all about nails. So cuties, I polled the question and you guys were 50-50 on wanting to see a PR unboxing and an Amazon nail supply haul. So I'm going to give y'all two videos this week and here it is. These are all the things that I got from Amazon. These are the nails that I just did and posted on Tuesday. So if you haven't seen that, check the description link for the link to this video or you can just go ahead over to my channel and check out the video yourself and other videos while you're there. <laughs> so this is the first thing that I got. Um, I got this, Panda makes some really nice drill bits y'all. So I got this um, safety nail carbide bit. It's a smooth bit and y'all can see that this is the five times coarse bit. Once I open it, you guys are gonna see exactly what I mean. I am so excited to get this and I can't wait to use it. I have a coarse bit already. It's um, a ceramic bit, but I wanna try this one out um, to see how much faster or how much easier it's gonna make my um, takedown on my nails because the gel system that I use, it's not soak off. I have to file it off. Even though I get through it pretty quick with my ceramic bit, I wanna try this carbide bit and because it's five times coarse, I wanted to make sure that I got a safety bit as well. This was not that expensive on Amazon. However, they um, it's supposed to go like forward and reverse. And I've noticed with Panna, some of their reverse options really doesn't go in reverse. So yeah, I'm just happy to get this one. I can't wait to use it. You guys can see how super huge the teeth are on this bit. I cannot wait to use this when I get ready to take down my nails again, which may not be anytime soon, but I cannot wait to use this bit for that. So cutie patooties, the next thing I got, I wanted to update my background little plush thing that I use to take photos. Even though purple is my favorite color and it's super cute, I feel like more neutral tones like whites and browns and tans and maybe black goes better when you're taking nail pictures. So I decided to just go ahead and get this white one. It, it brings out the picture, the nails a little bit more to me. It doesn't like clash as opposed to when I'm using the purple one. Even though this one is a lot smaller than the purple one that I have, they're made by the same company and this is odd. Um, if you guys want to know where anything, the links to any of these items that I got um, are on Amazon. I can link it. I'm not gonna link it in this video, but I can direct link it to you in your comment if there's anything here that you see that you wanna buy. It's super soft. The, the fur is kinda like in an odd position because of packaging, but I really feel like this is gonna bring out my pictures a little bit more, and I, I like it. Um, I'm just showing you guys here where the fur is like all messed up from packaging, but, and a lot of it is shedding too. I noticed that as opposed to the purple one that I have, but anyway, yep. I got this Archon mount, um, because the mount I had before, it just wasn't cutting it. I couldn't move the camera into the angle that I really wanted it. And so I'm glad to get this one. It was like 129 on Amazon because it also came with the stand for my tablet and it came with a little ring light, which I'm not gonna use the ring light, but the stand for the tablet is so convenient because I had another tablet stand. Well, I still have it, but it just, I didn't have enough room on my nail desk to put all of that there. So I like that that's there in that position. You guys can see it in a little video up top, but it came with everything I needed and I'm able to move this one around better to be able to capture the pictures the way that I want it and to be able to get the video in focus and you know in frame the way that I want it so the box is pretty huge that's why I'm like moving it around so you guys can see everything however I was super super glad that I got this at such a good price on Amazon because initially when I started looking at these about maybe six months ago maybe eight months ago they were so expensive and I was so glad to find this one. So I went ahead and snagged it right away. The next thing I got for lighting, I talked to you guys in my last video about lighting, was this light box here. It's a soft light box and I absolutely love it. And this is what I was talking about. Like I really need to get some rechargeable um, things 
so that way I'm not having so many things to plug in and using all these extension cords but I really really love this lamp and I'm gonna make sure I put a little you know small photo box up here with me showing you guys what it looks like but it's not super huge it has an on and off switch and you can toggle through the brightness and the setting as far as you wanting like a soft light warm light or whatever it is but it's not super big and you guys can see compared to my hand it's bigger than my hand but it's not that big that mount right there is one that I had previously and it was just a quick easy attach to that and I was good to go and my lamp is up there and I'm able to get the lighting that I need on that side of the table because the lighting coming through from the window just was not enough it just seems still so dark on the right side of my videos but you guys can see how big it is here from the the foam piece that's on the inside it's not super small and it's not extra huge simple on and off switch once you plug it in and you're good to go i like the lighting at this setting so that's why i'm just leaving it there and it's been working perfect for me so the next thing i got was this manicure um hand pillow for doing nails and the reason i got it was because of amia and sometimes when she wants to get her nails done and her little bestie whenever she comes over to get her nails done so i love how sturdy this pillow is it's soft but it's still very sturdy and i love that the legs are non-slip and the height is just perfect perfect for your nail lamp to go underneath it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pull everything out so you guys can see everything that it comes with. And then we're gonna go ahead and just attach it real quick, all the legs on there real quick. And I'll show you guys what I mean as far as the nail lamp going underneath it. I must say I can really really appreciate the legs on this pillow and that you're not going to be having it slipping around or moving around or anything like that and the price was a really good price too. So I also like this cute little gray underside. I thought that it was very very pretty and goes really good with the gray and white theme in my nail room. So I didn't even know that this underside was like this until I got it. But you guys can see how long this pillow is. So I'm just gonna like show you guys up to where my elbow is. And that's how long this pillow is. You guys can see the crease right there in my elbow. It's a big enough surface, both lengthways and widthways. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and attach the legs and I'll be back with you guys. Now that everything is all attached, just in there very sturdy, I'm just gonna flip this over, kind of just place my hand on it, press on it, kind of like move it around to see if it's gonna slip and there is no slipping. And you guys can see how sturdy the cushioning is, even though it's very nice and soft up top, it's not like, you know, fluffy soft, but it's soft enough to just kind of just be comfortable when you're resting your hands on it. And I'm just gonna go ahead and slide this nail lamp underneath and there's tons of room between the nail lamp and this pillow so again if you want to know the link to something that'll take you directly to it on amazon just leave me a comment down below and i will be sure to answer your comment you guys know i love chit chatting with you guys in the comment section and i will respond so i'll make sure i send you the link that way the next thing I've been interested in trying is this Young Nails Swipe. So I've been interested in this for a while. Unfortunately, when I went on Amazon, the pump bottle was no longer in stock. So I had to get the 32 ounce bottle. 
when I went ahead and I did a smell test, it smelled like alcohol mixed with something else. It wasn't just like straight alcohol. So I'm interested to see how this um, plays as a dehydrator and how it removes any dust and lint on the nails. But I'm just glad to still have this 32 ounce bottle because which means I'm gonna have this for a while because I'm getting ready to run low on alcohol and I just hate the fact that alcohol dries out my my fingers so much the skin around my fingers so this bottle has been empty I have not filled it up since I did this last set so I decided I'm just gonna go ahead and put some of this into this bottle but I stopped here because I remembered I had a tiny funnel but I could not find it so I'm gonna have to go ahead and fill this up later once I find that tiny funnel that I have you know how it is you have so many nail supplies and then you just can't remember where the one little thing is that you need but when you're not looking for it it's in your face right y'all know exactly what I'm talking about so I'm gonna fill this up later and I'll let y'all know how it works in my next video so the next thing I got, which I've already used, were for my cuties. They also got their nails done before baby arrived. They wanted these stickers. They found them on Amazon, and I went ahead and did what moms do. I went ahead and bought it for them. And I'm just going to go through and let you guys take a look. These were super, super cute cartoon character stickers. The Pink Panther would be one that I would probably definitely use in a set if I try to remember. Hello Kitty, you know, they go crazy about these little characters. Mickey, Minnie, Pooh Bear, Bugs Bunny, Pikachu, all the different little characters and even some, um, what are those, anime characters that my older one she likes. So I've used some of these stickers, like you guys can see, I've used the Bart Simpsons one and I also used the Sailor Moon one because they wanted a set with those. And they even came with some of these, which I thought was odd. But hey, even Mickey is on here doing stuff. But anyway, I got those and they absolutely love them. And their stickers are still holding on four weeks later. But it's time for them to get a new set. Um, it came with these as well. And I was just wondering, did I make a mistake in purchasing these? Because I don't like water decals. And I don't know why I did. I think maybe my older one wanted these because they're super kawaii, super anime. And I was like, maybe she showed me these? And I didn't pay attention to the fact that they weren't stickers and they're actually water decals. I just don't like that they're on these super big sheets. So I'm gonna have to cut them down with my paper cutter and I'm just gonna store them away in my little um, sticker book that I have. But these are very, very kawaii, very, very, very anime. And I don't know what it was about these little, you know, these feathers here. I don't know what that was about, but they wanted them and I got them. And I really, really like these little baby Minnie and Mickeys on here. They're super cute. So I'll be doing more of their nail designs with these. I don't show you guys their nail designs because they're always so super random. They're always crazy looking. But I got these for my girlies and I may or may not use them in a set. I have no clue, cuties. Probably definitely the Pink Panther, but I don't know. We will see. Y'all know my style. I'm not really into the kawaii nails, even though they're super cute. It's, it's just not me, but it is what it is. We'll see if I use these in the future for a video for you guys. So the next thing I got that I used, and it's crazy because I've been looking at these and they also sent me... A link to this like my girls they get with their big sister and they get on Amazon they look at stuff and then she texts me all these links but I've been wanting these and they picked these also and I was like oh my gosh I've been wanting these I really love how these little flowers y'all have been seeing them all over YouTube and Instagram and stuff I love how they come in different sizes and they come with the caviar beads as well even though I thought it was gonna be much more in the containers there's still a good amount, but I just hate how they depict the containers to have so much in them. And then when you get them, it's just a tiny little bit. So I'll get a couple uses out of this, but it's something that you have to restock on. I've yet to get a package that's like stocked to the brim when it comes to little embellishments like that. But I got a variety of colors and I love that. Probably not gonna make another purchase, 
but I used it on the girls and they loved it. So cuties, that is it. I did get one more thing and it's just a nail rack because I'm stocking up on gel polishes and stuff. But I just wanna tell you guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to come back next Tuesday for another video. And again, if you wanna see how I did this set, the link is in the description down below. And as always cuties, love you guys and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye.